G'day guys, right here with Hugh from Slayer. Hey guys. Thanks for talking with us today. You're gonna to take us through the Slayer home machine today and some of the functions and features uh, so that if you're interested in looking at buying a Slayer, you can uh, find out all about it right here. So yeah, take us through um, everything with this beautiful home machine. The Slayer single group product is, it is for domestic, but we think of this as a commercially capable machine. So all of the components in this machine are the same as what we have on the machine over there that we're building, uh, which is a two-group uh, V3, right? So this machine shares all of its compatibility, all of its componentry, and is designed uh, as a very like temperature-stable, very consistent, uh, high-end espresso machine that's going to give you the most amazing coffee in your home or in your office, roastery, you know, low-volume kind of cafe, brew bar, wherever you happen to be. So that's the, the kind of segment for this machine. What sets the Slayer product apart uh, from any other is our patented needle valve. Uh, so this machine is a flow profiling machine. So what that means is we are restricting the flow rate of the water in the early stages of the extraction to allow you to get more texture, more sweetness, and this amazing coating body. Um, so the way that this machine does this is uh, when, we're, when we're interacting with the machine, when it's in this first position, this, the water is passing through the needle valve. For the coffee that I have in the hopper at the moment, it's a little more developed than some of the coffees that we would normally run. Um, so I'm running a flow rate of 60 grams over 30 seconds. So if you're running blends, if you're running coffees that are, have a little bit more body, uh, that's great. And then we transition across to the full pump flow rate, right? So you can see that there's two very different speeds there. Um, and again, what that is allowing us to do is to manipulate the flavor of the espresso and to manipulate the tactile experience, tactile body, uh, to give you what you want. So with the, the more developed coffees, 60 grams over 30 seconds is great. If I was running something a little lighter through this grinder, I'd be looking at maybe like 45 or 50 grams, right? So it's designed as a variable that we can change and then it's locked in. So you can be consistent, in your home or in your cafe or in your roastery. Um, so we're using a mechanical valve to do that rather than like a conical uh, or an electronic pump. Um, so it's, it's a very consistent way of achieving a particular flavor. The first obvious thing with the Slayer is how beautiful it is. And Slayer have been producing beautiful machines since I think 2007, I think they started yeah, there. Yeah, correct. And um, yeah, with the development into the um, domestic use or this like you said the small roaster mm. uh, use I think this sort of sits in uh, what price point are we looking at for around this it's sitting at Australian this price at around 14k yeah, yeah. yes which is yeah. great for like any small like roast that's wanting to really dial in their coffee recipes and you know see it at the different stages of development as well absolutely and their roast types so yeah I think this is a perfect one you know also for the home user if you are really into your coffee yeah you really want to produce super high quality coffee not only that but something that's going to be an art piece on your kitchen bench as well absolutely yeah. and we have a like quite a large uh, community of home users who are brewing extraordinary coffee at home um, and you know obviously having this as the centerpiece of the yeah. kitchen where they're really able to to show it off so for me this is a this is kind of a unique experience uh, our, our big thing this year for Slayer has been uh, moving and upgrading our production facility so we're handmade in Seattle. We've just moved 10 minutes down the road into a larger space uh, to facilitate our growth as we're kind yeah. of growing and developing. So we've got, um, you guys are a little early this morning, but uh, Griffin has flown out from the US and has been building this machine over the course of the show. All oh, right. Um, so we've got everything on display here, which is quite unique, right? Yeah. If you come into my showroom, we can play coffee, but uh, <laughs> we don't have the, the guts of the machine out like this necessarily. So I'll just quickly point out, uh, on this machine, all the components here, the needle valve assembly, that's identical to what's in the single group. These boilers uh, and the solenoids are the same as what you see in the single group, as is the water path uh, and the steam valves. Um, the hot water tap is slightly different on the single group, but essentially, uh, and then all the components in the, in the steam boiler are just shrunk down, right? So again, we're getting, you're benefiting from all of Slayer's commercial capability, from all the hard work that goes into developing machines that are designed to last for a long time at high volume in that in that kind of single group either home or low volume commercial environment so that's
what you're paying for. It's like when you buy an expensive sports car, yeah. sure, it looks nice, <laughs> but what you're paying for is what's inside, right? That's and right? It's the same with Slayer. We take a lot of care with the way that our products look, but really where all the extra care goes is, is under the hood, right? Um, so all of these components are, again, designed to last for a long time and perform very, very well um, yeah, over, over a long period and at, at high volume. Yeah. Ah, thanks. This is awesome looking under this, and we'll, we'll try and pop back and, and catch. Are they all handcrafted then? Yeah. yeah. Every, every, everything is made by hand in yeah. Seattle. Yeah. yeah. So when you order a machine from Slayer, it doesn't like come off a shelf, yeah. off a box in a factory. It's the guys get together and they make it, particularly when you're doing factory customization from us. Uh, the wood is all hand turned. You can see we've got some actuators up on the wall. But uh, this is the stock uh, European ash. Um, European ash wood. We have about 20 different options that you can order the machines with. And they're literally, the order comes in, the guys lathe the handles, they're, you know, polishing and carving the wood for the actuators. Um, so it's a very bespoke, handcrafted yeah. product. Thank you so much for talking with us today, Hugh. My that pleasure. was fantastic. Yeah. And yeah, obviously you can see the precision, the craftsmanship of the Slayer, whether you're buying in the commercial two group, three groups, or for the domestic single group. It, they are perfect for every sort of, I mean, even using this single group there, you're gonna be able to pump out a couple of hundred coffees on that easily, no problems, yeah. right? So whether you're doing small volume or high volume, you can see the craftsmanship in all of their machines. Mm. It's absolutely brilliant to watch. And uh, yeah, thank you very much for talking with us. My pleasure. I'm Ryder, your coffee coach, and enjoy your brew.